Hi, I'm Stevie T, and today we're doing a top 10 best songs with dual guitar. That's dual guitar, D-U-A-L, not duel guitar. Now obviously my list isn't the definitive top 10 dual guitar list, but I pulled together a few different opinions and my own opinion to put this list together for you. So let's start off with number 10 on our list. Now Paul Stanley and Ace Frehley aren't normally known for their dual guitar work, but in our number 10 song, they certainly are. Here's Kiss with Detroit Rock City. So for number 9 on our list, I'm going to include something newer, something metal. And I thought Avenged Sevenfold is a wicked band, and Zacky Vengeance and Sinister Gates are known for their dual guitar work as well. So for the metal crowd, here's Coming Home by Avenged Sevenfold. Now our next band I feel is very underappreciated, but Michael Wilton and Chris DeGarmo of Queensryche have created some of the most amazing dual guitar work in history. Operation Mindcrime is a complete masterpiece, and that's why they're on this list. At number 8, Queensryche, Eyes of a Stranger. Now this next band is absolutely known for their dual guitar work. K.K. Downing and Glenn Tipton are a couple of the most famous guitar duos in rock history. So they have number 7 on our list, Judas Priest, and the intro to Electric Eye, The Hellion. Now this next band on our list is one of the biggest rock bands in history, Boston. And Boston's guitarist Tom Schultz is absolutely known for his incredible guitar tone. And he was known for layering many guitar tracks over one another to create his amazing sound. And not only that, he also created some of the best dual guitar riffs in history. And here's one of my favorites, Boston, Don't Look Back. Now in the 80s, there was a wave that swept the nation, and it was neoclassical shred rock. Led by bands such as Cacophony, which included the guitar duo of Jason Becker and Marty Friedman. And of course, Racer X, which included the guitar duo of Bruce Bouillet and Paul Gilbert. Now realistically, both of these bands' entire repertoire could be in this list. But for the sake of diversity, we're going to include one song. And it's by Racer X. 
Scarified. Now this next song on our list is by one of the biggest selling rock bands of all time, the super group known as The Eagles. And the guitar team of Glenn Fry, Joe Walsh, and Don Felder have given us this masterpiece of guitar duo re and it's at number four on our list, The Eagles, Hotel California. Now if there is one band known for their dual guitar work, it's gotta be Iron Maiden. The guitar team of Adrian Smith, Dave Murray, and Yannick Gares, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, have created some of the most iconic dual guitar work in history. So it was really hard to choose which song, but I decided to go with The Trooper. And it's at number three on our list. Now we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Now this next song on our list is an absolute classic. And it's not Fat Lizzie, it's Thin Lizzie. Now maybe not a lot of other people would put this song this high up on the list, but it's one of my absolute favorite dual guitar riffs in history. Thin Lizzie, the boys are back in town. Well, we've made it to number one on our list. What could it be? So let's go back to Marty Friedman for a second. After Marty Friedman left Cacophony, he joined a little known band called Megadeth with Dave Mustaine. And together they created this absolute masterpiece of dual guitar. In fact, pretty much the entire song is dual guitar work. Now I'm not gonna play the entire thing for you, but I'm gonna play a little bit of it. And it's number one on our list, Megadeth, Hangar 18. Well there you have it folks, I hope you somewhat agree with me in my list. And of course it's always possible I may have forgot a song. So if you have a great dual guitar song that you think I missed, put it in the comment section and let everyone else know that I failed you. Well that was very fun, I hope to do it again very soon, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!